Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back here with the next episode of Mass Effect 2 with the Soldier Series. Before we get into the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications so you can be notified of all my videos. That being said, let's get down to it. Okay. Make sure it is working. Okay. I always gotta make sure the recording's working before I start the game because sometimes OBS with the hotkeys it, it doesn't work right so I didn't want to play the game and think I was recording when in reality I wasn't so that's why I always do that but no um I made a short a recent short I learned how to eat with chopsticks it's so cool I had um I went to the Chinese restaurant around here got some General Tso's chicken with fried rice and um, I saw the chopsticks on the counter I was paying for my takeout order and um, I'm like you know what I'm gonna learn how to I'm gonna learn how to eat with chopsticks I've, I've always tried when I was a kid but could never get the hang of it but um, now it, it's just cool it, it, it's now I can actually do it. And it's just so cool. It, it's so cool. I mean, I know it's small and minuscule, but um, you know, it. it, it I don't know. I don't know. I, I mean, it, it's just so cool. I'm I'm able to eat with chopsticks. I'm just like Sheldon and Leonard and Raj and Howard from um. From Big Bang Theory. <laughs> we are getting some lag here. It'll clear up in a minute. Thanks for diverting to the Gurns back, Shepard. I appreciate being able to clean up that mess. And don't worry, it will not affect how I do my job. It's over. I'm interested in getting to know you better. Already? I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. Let's do this later. We'll talk later. Okay. Hey, Commander. Okie dokie, Smokies. We're ready to go do a mission. Like I said, I'm doing all these um, side missions first because I want all the money I can get before going to Hub Worlds. That way, then. Only half our fuel remains. That way, then, I can. Um, buy everything at the hub worlds like Chachanka and um Ilium you know because that stuff gets pretty expensive so so Jack Garris Tally we'll do Jack first then we'll do Tally and then we'll do um Project Overlord. Nothing like a good glass of orange juice in the morning get you woke, get you to wake up, you know. It's just the frozen stuff, but hey, it's it's good. One thing that's on my Christmas list this year um, is a, one of them personal blenders from Hamilton Beach. It's like a 14 ounce single serving one and I, all I'm going to use it for is making smoothies. One of the types of drinks I'm going to make is Orange Julius's. Because there's a copycat recipe online on how to make them and so hell yeah. But mostly I'm going to make fresh fruit smoothies. Like fresh berries and stuff like that. Like I don't know if this episode will 
be out before Christmas. I don't think it will be, but um, but if not, oh well. I mean, that's what I'm gonna be getting this year for myself is a uh, um one of them. I'm gonna wait till I, I waited till Black Friday to get me a stand mixer. I actually found one um, cheaper than a freaking KitchenAid. It was actually again from Hamilton Beach. It was half the price of a KitchenAid, but it had just as all the features, the same features as the KitchenAid. So why pay, you know, two three hundred dollars for the KitchenAid brand when I can pay eighty for the same exact machine? but from a different company, you know? Launched. I'm gonna use, I use that for Christmas, you know, because I cook every year for Christmas. And um, I thought that'd be a nice little thing to have to make the mashed potatoes and, um, you know, make the pie crust and make the bread dough and, Here we go, Pragya. We're gonna help Jack. Miranda. So we can get that boost in, um, Okay. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last, assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. Get a hold of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. We're gonna use our sniper rifle this time. I want to watch this place burn. Oh, we will, Jack. We will. <laughs> I never saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They were messed up and starving, but alive. Usually. Lock terminal. We'll take the money it offers. Okay. The elusive man requests an operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. When we get results, he won't care what we did. But if he knew, he won't find out. The elusive man re it was it. Sounds like this facility went rogue. You'd like to think that, wouldn't you? He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. I'm just looking for items. Um, I can't remember if there's any in the in here or not. Um, We've been spotted. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. 
What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight, filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. They actually rewarded you for attacking? I still get warm feelings during a fight. What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hell yeah. Hey, guy. Get. Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the. That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Things might have happened that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me. The guards attacked me. The automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a fresh kill. Right? All that just for some element zero. Huh. Gets you in the head. Nice job, Zach. Let her kill. A lot of children died here. Even then, they were part of the experiment. Bullshit. I had the worst of it, and I made it out alive. Hmm, guy. Keep you from going that way, bastards. There we go. So strange to be back here. I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch, but then I'm a little girl again. Shit, it's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. Okay. Boom. We got Baron. There. I ain't wasted my ammo on fucking Baron, you know. Fuck no, just use the melee attacks against the Baron.
cell was on the other side. I could see all the other kids out here. I screamed at them for hours, and they always ignored me. Right? Hey, guy. I must have come through here when I broke out, but I don't remember it. This is a bad place. I'm just checking to see if there's any items doesn't look like it. So Subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. You can't help what they did to <clears throat> others. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was <laughs> tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on harder and tougher. Research thing to hack. Okay. It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give... Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an Alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. There was a lot going on. I was dumb. I keep my eyes open now, and I always shoot first. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Okay. It's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put them down. Then I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What are you doing here? First, we're gonna kill you. Then, we'll see. Kill them on my own. I want them dead. I had you scoped, had you not fallen back. Got his ass. Oh, I didn't know you snuck up behind me. Huh. Got uh, your ass. Oh, there he is. Ah. Nice job, Jack. Only room left is my old cell. Whoever Aresh is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. Okay. Got some. Ammo, even though we're not going to need it. There we go. More creds. Come out. 
We know you're here. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Looks like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this, but a place like this, it doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew, how to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You'd do the same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. There's no reason good enough. Are you nuts? You lived it. All right. This place was like a prison. How did you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. Jack, he's trapped in his past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. He's crazy, and he's never going to restart this facility. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. Fuck. Get out of here. Go. He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. Okay, and then you come out here for the old blood smear. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Okay, that's it for that mission. Okay, so we leveled up from that. We got Jack's new power, new outfit, got her biotic damage upgrade. Her and Miranda both. And tomorrow when we get her. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. We'll deal with that in a minute. Um... Biotic damage. Biotic cooldown. 
That should be everything for armors. So all we need is just the weapon upgrades, which I think we all we buy them all in um Okay, so Leslie was the doctor from uh, Aya. Um, she made it off, and now the doctors are helping her. Um, she's just saying, thank you for getting me out of that hell. That's what all she was saying. Okay, we're going to see Jack real quick. to wipe that place off the map. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. You don't know what it's like, Shepard, to have garbage like that following you. It marks you in ways you... you don't expect. I've made a lot of hard choices, Jack. Like what to let go. Hard to walk away from it. You'd think it would get easier now that the place is a crater. But what else do I know? I never thought I'd see you show mercy, but you let a wretch live. He was trapped in the past, reliving it every day. You showed how that could be me. I'm not getting stuck like that. I'm better than him, and I'm sure as hell not carrying that crater around with me. Do you think you're different now? I know that place is gone, but I still kind of want to kill every person I see. No offense. You sure about this? I want to do whatever I can to get your head on straight. Don't get all therapist on me, Shepard. You're not the couch type. I hate that stuff anyway. Bullshit prison psych. You did me a favor, and that's enough. More than I expected. I'll keep it together. Okay. That's all we needed from Jack. Just to get the Paragon points. Now we'll go on to the next mission, which will be to get, um, we'll help Garrus and then we'll get Tally. Why not? That way we can have Garrus ready to go. And then we'll go recruit Tally. If I can speak. There we go. And so we're going to help Garrus. That's all we need to do here. Sit it out. Bring out Garrus. Bring out Miranda, because we need her weapon boost. Okay. Okay. Every five seconds, the main gun of an Everest class dreadnought accelerates one. So we go down to the bottom floor to go to the warehouse. 
This looks like the place. The Ford. I just got a refund in exchange, and I was told to pick up a new off the jail converter here. I don't think you have the right place. No. be deceiving. So, which one of you wants to disappear? I'd rather see you make someone reappear. Ah, uh, that's not the service we provide. Make an exception. Just this once. Damn it! Quick! Shoot them! Too slow. <laughs> Hell yeah. Why do I even bother? We're looking for someone. A client of yours. Not mine. I'm not Fade. I just work for him. Sort of. I knew it. Well, then maybe you'd like to tell us where to find him. Did, yes, of course. He's in the factory district. Works out of the old prefab foundry. I know the place. Oh, he's got a lot of mercs there. Blue Suns. Harkin thinks they're protecting him. How the hell did Harkin end up being the Fade? Well, he got fired from CSEC a while back. He used his knowledge of CSEC and their systems to help a few people disappear. Then he made himself disappear, and Fade was born, so to speak. Interesting. But it changes nothing. We still need to find him before we can get to Sedona's. Well, let's go pay Harkin a visit. We'll need to go to the transit station. I can get us to him from there. So I, uh... I can go? Sure, but if we don't find Harkin, we'll be back for you. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, there it is. Sure, we got some renegade points for that, but it's easier than having to fight him. It's a decision on the job. He said there'd be one waiting for me. Do you have a service order? But we need to go to the factory district. There we go. Miss Miranda. I thought I could get him. That's all right. Take the med kit. Unit 
There we go. Fuck. There. Why waste the ammo when you can pick up now with a melee? There we go. Oh wait, Garrus, there we go. Looking for ammo, they didn't drop any, bastards. Oh shit. What are those two shotgun wielders? There we go. You two take care of them. Got him. This laptop here. Oh, screwed up. There we go. There we go. Oh, 
There we go. Got you open. What the hell is Hawking up to? We'll find out in a minute here, Garrus. You just want to get everything first. Forge IDs, we use those later. So, Harkin's finally gone completely bad. He was always a pain in the ass, but I'm in no mood for his games. If he doesn't cooperate, I'll beat him within an inch of his life. You seem to be getting tense, Garrus. Harkin may know why Sedonis wanted to disappear. If so, he knows why we're here, and I don't want him tipping Sedonis off. something he's getting ready for us what do you think Parkins got waiting for us in there not sure it looks like an industrial complex heavy machinery could be anything something's in there probably more blue suns Harkins kind of trapped himself in a corner he must have something in store for us well there's one way to find out right behind you Okay, act terminal here. This should come in handy. For a sniper rifle damage, I'll take that. Okay, now I need to uh, get the sniper rifle. There we got him. Oh, can't get him from here. Alright. There we go. Then what is it you're doing, idiot? Harkin's going to regret this. Oh crap. Two heavy mechs incoming. Do you really think you can take me down? Shepard. Yeah, always try to get the heads off of the heavy mechs. You can make them go nuclear. And there's Harkin staring at us. There we go. You were clear. 
close, but not close enough. <laughs> So, fade. Couldn't make yourself disappear, huh? Come on, Garrus. We can work this out. What do you need? I'm looking for someone. Well, I guess we both have something the other one wants. We're not here to ask favors, Harkin. You don't say. You helped a friend of mine disappear. I need to find him. I might need a little more information than that. His name was Sidonis. Torian came from the... I know who he is, and I'm not telling you squat. Harkin, this doesn't have to be hard. Screw you. I don't give out client information. It's bad for business. <clears throat> you know what else is bad for business? A broken neck. Uh, all right, all right. Get off me! Changed you, huh, Gareth? No, but Sidonis opened my eyes. Now arrange a meeting. chance your identity may be compromised. That's why I'm calling. I'm sending an agent. Where do you want to meet? All right, he'll be there. Don't worry, I got it covered. It's all good. He wants to meet you in front of Orbital Lounge, middle of the day. So if our business is done, I'll be going. I don't think so. You're a criminal now, Harkin. So what? You're just gonna kill me? That's not your style, Garrus. Kill you? No. But I don't mind slowing you down a little. You don't need to shoot him. He won't be able to hide from C-Sec now. I guess it's your lucky day. Yeah. I hope we can do this again real soon. <laughs> <sighs> I didn't shoot him. Come on, let's move. Yeah. Sedonis better be there, or I'm coming back to finish the job. Yeah, you're right, Garrus. She didn't shoot him. <laughs> Harkin's a bloody menace. We shouldn't have just let him go. He deserved to be punished. I'm getting a little worried about you, Garrus. You were pretty hard on Harkin. You don't think he deserved it? It's just not like you. What do you want from me, Shepard? What would you do if someone betrayed you? I'm not sure, but I wouldn't let it change me. I would have said the same thing before it happened to me. It's not too late. You don't have to go through with this. Who's going to bring Sidonis to justice if I don't? Nobody else knows what he's done. Nobody else cares. I don't see any other options. Let me talk to him. Talk all you want, but it won't change my mind. I don't care what his reasons were. He screwed us. He deserves to die. I understand what you're going through, but do you really want to kill him? I appreciate your concern, but I'm not you. This isn't you either. Really? I've always hated injustice. The thought that Sidonis could get away with this? Why should he go on living while ten good men lie in unmarked graves? I'm sorry, Shepard. Words aren't going to solve this problem. I need to set up. I can get a clear shot from over there. What do you need me to do? Keep him talking and don't get in my way. I'll let you know when he's in my sights. Give me a signal so I know you're ready, and I'll take the shot. You better go. We'll be here soon.
Shepard, can you hear me? Loud and clear. All right. There he is. Wave him over and keep him talking. Let's get this over with. You're in my shot. Move to the side. This won't take long at all. You want a Harkins, man? I don't remember seeing you before. That's it. Just keep him talking a few more seconds. I was told Harkin was one of the best. This better not happen again. Oh, it won't. Don't worry. What? Shit. Betrayal repaid Sidonis. That was easy enough. Plain and simple. Good work. Thanks for helping me, Shepard. Let's get moving. I need to get away from this place. Right with you. Okay. So we got Garrus's loyalty done. There we go. Okay, we can get out of here. Okay. But we'll have enough to get his armor piercing ammo maxed. All right, cool. We can get out of here. We're going to go recruit Tally and do Project Overlord. Because we'll need Tally for Project Overlord. You can make do without Tally, but um, she's a tech expert and you fight Geth at Project Overlord, so... That way, then, we can have that done and... Okay, Cerberus Intel saying, hey, in Pragia, we didn't know what was going on. Um... Oh, no, the... Lucid Man wanted us to know what was going on. Zerberus personnel arrived to find all the guards dead, along with most of the subjects. Any surviving children were treated for injuries, given mild uh, amnestic, amnestic um, treatments, and delivered to Alliance facilities as survivors of slaver attacks. A few of the doctors were forcibly retired for their role in the project. And the facility on Pragio had been destroyed. Okay. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Now, we're going to get that sniper rifle upgrade. Which, there is no other upgrade for the sniper rifle. It's just, we get squad bonus of 40%. No messages for you, Commander. Okay. Tally's mission is not really that long, or I don't think it is. But first... We're gonna check... Here...
probe launched. Okay. And Hailstrom. Here we go. So we'll need Garish for this one because he's uh he's got overload as well as Miranda, so And then you're supposed to stay out of the sun. The tally is somewhere in these ruins. There is considerable geth activity and an environmental hazard. Solar output has overwhelmed Hastrum's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. Okay. Yeah, all it does is take down your shields. You won't die from being in the sun. Having serious issues with my shields. We need to stay out of the sunlight. Okay. Incoming dropship. Okay, I think we need the. A... There we go. Love this rifle. <laughs> Think it's down this way. We got the customized heavy pistol. We'll take that. Oh, we will.
There we go. Shit. The collectors know how to make an assault rifle, let me tell you. <laughs> There we go. I know I could use a disruptor ammo, but... I know I could use the, um, disruptor ammo and it would do more damage to the Geth, but you get just as much damage out of the, um, Inferno ammo. Well, let me see. Okay. Heavy son of a bitch from there we go.
Okay. And the other demo charge is in here. There we go. Iridium. We won't need to do that, Garrus. I know you want us to go to the left, but we can't. That destroyer would stop us. Burn that some bitch. Okay, I was out of my fucking position right there. I know you're supposed to flank them, but the problem is you can't. You have the fucking heavies to deal with. They will get around you if you try to flank them. See, they tell you, go to the left. Well, how do you go to the left if there's nothing here? See, but then you have the overheating issue. So you can't go to the left. You just can't. Take that. These buildings are Quarian. This colony predates the Geth uprising. And why would the Quarians come here? Whatever they're after, I hope it's worth it. Okay, you're gonna get your locust back. Because it's more powerful than. Tully's order to base camp. Come. Min base camp. Be well in a second, Tally. There. Gotta get your items first. You gotta get your items first. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Call re 
Krieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of Geth outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth and the console is damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please do what you can to keep Rieger alive. Okay. They see you, Shepard. Looks like the trucks have an optical camouflage system. There we go. that drone out of here. There we go. Bastard. There. Okay, nothing here but the lockdown. Okay. Someone's firing rockets at you. The Geth are near platoon strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. Huddles up and fixes itself. I can't get a clear shot while it's down like that. I tried to move in closer, and one of the bastards punched a shot clean through my suit. We need to get the tally. Got any ideas? Just one! I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger. And I got a rocket launcher that the sun hasn't fried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy. Maybe even drop its shields. If luck, you'll be able to finish it off. You've done enough, Rieger. You don't need to throw your life away. Wasn't asking your permission. My job is to keep Tally safe. <sighs> we don't have enough people on our side for you to take one for the team. Stand down. 
I'm not gonna stand there while you run into enemy fire. They killed my whole squad. And if you wanna honor your squad, watch my back. I need you here in case they bring reinforcements. <clears throat> All right, Shepard, we'll do it your way. Hit him for me. Keep us alive. Enemies in front. <clears throat> Okay, so we need to get over to the right. Light up. Oh, we'll light him up, all right. Okay, I need my sniper rifle. I need to take these bastards out. One by one. Ugh. That works. Good job. Okay. Scratch one. Need the med kit. All right. Down to cover. All right, now we take the son of a bitch down. Just a second. I locked the door to keep more guests from getting inside. There, that should do it. There. I love that particle right that particle beam. I really do. It's way overpowered in this game. Just let me finish this download. Thank you, Shepard. If not for you, I would never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. And if the Admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Maybe not the whole rest of your team, ma'am. Rieger, you made it. Your old captain's as good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. Ah, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty board and let him know what happened. She's all yours now, Shepard. Keep her safe. All right. Now we got Tally on the um, team. I know I said I'd do Project Overload, Lord, but I'm getting hungry. Um, my blood sugar, I, I, don't, I don't think it's going low, but... Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Tally Zora. We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. I don't know who you are, but Cerberus threatened the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. That's why you're here, Tally. I need people who aren't Cerberus. People I can trust. 
I wasn't part of what happened to the migrant fleet, but I understand your distrust. I hope we'll get past that as we work together. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you, not for them. If it helps, check out the Normandy while you're here. We've gotten a few upgrades. I'll get Talizor the necessary security clearance to access our systems. Please do. I can't be part of your team if I don't know how the ship works. Remember, Shepard, these people thought enslaving Thorian creepers and Rachni was a good idea. I'll be in engineering. Don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie, the ship's new artificial intelligence. <laughs> But yeah, I'm getting hungry, so, you know, I'm going to have to stop here. As much as I would love to keep going, I just can't. I, I got to get something to eat, so. so. We'll do our weapon upgrades. There we go. And that should be all of them, I think. Yep, it is. Okay. Well, that's going to be it for this episode, so I hope you all had fun. Sorry I'm leaving so early, but I I, I have to, because I, like I said, I'm getting hungry. So, um, I will see you all in the next episode.